good afternoon. Wheel is at large. We're out again. We're just going for an after work ride, but uh, a coffee ride. Brought our own coffee. Coffee and cake down on the seafront. That's annoying. We just missed the train going over the bridge. Oh well. Anyway, before I start getting comments, I do only have one, and yes, it's been washed a lot. <laughs> Maybe I should get some more. I've redone this bit of gravel, so it's quite thick actually. <laughs> I'm going through mud. <laughs> Boxer socks. Looking forward to get back to that, I am. So we're wearing a loud shirt and a built up area. <laughs> and for possessing a, an offensive wife. That's it. That was the other one, wasn't it? What was the other? There was another one as well, wasn't there? So you can't say the other ones in this day and age because people get offended. Yeah. Oh, blimey. Do you think I'll ever be able to get away from that? You think she does it for fun, don't you? For the camera, which well, she does it for fun, for sure, but she does it all the bloody time. I'll tell you what, in the car, if we go under a bridge, she goes, yeah. <laughs> Just to remind me. Go. Oh, smell that! Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, it's like being assaulted, isn't it? There's was churros back there, and now it's fish and chips. <laughs> so it looks like the goats have been moved along. They were back there behind Harry Ramsden's, well, by by the uh, the new beach huts. They're usually up at Boscombe. Maybe there's some up there as well. Quite a lot of fit people out tonight. <laughs> The strange thing is most of them are riding scooters. You'd think they'd be running and working out and stuff, but no, nope. riding scooters. Oh, and of course there's one riding a bike. Brownie points, it's gotta be worth something, surely. Yeah. Ford Cortina GXL Mark III and it sounded like it had more than just a push button stereo in it. <laughs> See that roof there and that railing? That's where Martin Ashton did one of his uh, road bike party tricks. Yeah, on his Colnago. On the back wheel, jump down onto the railing and then down onto the road. Yeah, that was just back there. We get the coffee, we'll go for a harvester instead. I'll go in the harvester instead of coffee. That doesn't sound like a bad idea, to be honest. Are we still celebrating my birthday? We're we still celebrating that you're now older than me. Is that what we're celebrating? Do you know you can go off, people? <laughs> yeah, good handful. That's what you do. No worries, thank you. It's no problem, thank you. That's <laughs> no problem. We've given up running over children, it doesn't pay. Hey, where'd that wind 
come from? Our car's covered in food, you know. Oh, is it? Yeah. You better wash it then. I'd rather be on the bike. I wash the bikes, you wash the car. There's a deal. Uh, yeah, so I've sort of made a decision. <laughs> I'm building another gravel bike but I haven't told the accountant yet but uh, anyway whatever happens with the tough road even if I take it back as it is all the stuff that I bought to make it my bike as it were no longer fits so I've made that decision cheap cheerful gravel frame and fork set on the way and uh, I'm probably going to go 650B and then turn this one back into a road bike. Take it from there. I'm going to see the sea. Sand, sand, sand. There we go. It's the other way. We were supposed to be going to the Isle of Wight at the weekend, but it's not going to work now. Uh, Judy's got roped into some out of hours stuff that needs to be done. And um, to be honest, I could do a catching up with some work. So uh, it kind of works quite nicely. <laughs> but um, means hopefully we'll get out Friday night. Might get out Sunday, depends what time Julie finishes. Anyway, we brought some um, some coffee with us and a cake, so uh, that's what I'm doing now. unmistakable track of a Panaracer Gravel King. I think Mike's gone mad. <laughs> they were taking their lunch down to the uh, seafront too. Yeah, they probably hired a beach hut and they've just gone shopping. So that'll be their breakfast ah, and dinner for tomorrow. Yeah, that's possible. Christchurch Priory on the uh, skyline there. Which way would she go? Let's see. Ah, she's going with the wind. Well done. Go on, you could have done that. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, oh, yeah, that's me. <laughs> not sure, but that is social distancing. No, definitely not social distancing. But that's okay because they're probably part of each other's bubble. <laughs> <laughs> so there's no way you're going to see it with the GoPro, but out there. There is smoke on the water, there's lights, there's boats, there's two Chinooks we've just seen fly off out to sea. I can only just see it with the you know, naked eye, so I'm not sure the GoPro is going to pick up any of it. But you know, we'll enhance it, give it a go. You never know. Anyway. Thank you. They did, the kids, they know their technology. I mean, they don't know what it's like to climb a tree, but they know their technology. <laughs> oh, for crying out loud, honestly. What? <laughs> You've worked in an office for so many years. You think everything starts at nine and finishes at five. <laughs> 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 yeah, 
Yeah, for about 95% of the time that we ride together, it works really well, but every now and then, yeah, it can be a bit frustrating. I'm sure Julie feels the same as well, but yeah. But generally speaking, we kind of know each other well enough now. And it kind of goes quite well and we can ride very close together. We know exactly how much space we each need. It's just when I give you a push. That... Yeah, it's just when you push me along because I'm getting tired. I need that every now and then these days. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think your irons though. No, probably not now. Yeah, they didn't want my blood though, did they? Yeah, that vegetarian thing was probably a mistake. Julie's iron got very low. I think if we were to do that again, we need to be a bit more, we need to look into it. We need to do it right. Um, we did try and do it right, but obviously not well enough. So yeah, Julie got quite depleted apparently. And uh, she's had to go on iron supplements and stuff. And now she's back to normal, but yeah, let's not say never again. Let's just say we need to do it better next time if we do it. Six months was a fair try. Oh yeah, six months was a fair go, yeah, absolutely. I liked it to start with. Yeah, well I think you feel like you're doing the right thing to start with, don't you? And that gets you over most of it, but evidently for your health it wasn't the right thing. I knew it wasn't right at the end. Because yeah. I was and bad yeah. Watch out behind you, Julie. Wow. What was that? A mate. A mate. Yeah. Big chunky e-bike. This is where we do the white Christmas dip usually. Might actually happen this year, which would be nice. Yeah. About a thousand people will run into the sea on Christmas morning. We'll see. We'll see if it's allowed to come back. Right, we've got to be careful here because cars reverse out. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. There you go, that's a nice. Some of those CrossFit bike things. You used to be able to fit through that gap, but they moved the post over one. You can't anymore. I wonder how many people got caught out with that in the, in the dark in the early morning or late at night. So they must be in here. There's a fence here. Yeah. There they are. It's in the tree. Good man, look at that. I don't think that these scooters are really designed for two people. But you see it quite a lot. Dancing on the seafront. Right, we made it through. Nobody died, nobody got hurt. Oh. Oh. See, the thing is, you do it, you gesticulate, and then you shout late. That's the way to do it. Well, 
if you've watched this far into the video and you've listened to our <laughs> drivel <laughs> and you're still awake yeah well done <laughs> i was gonna say thank you for watching but okay <laughs> click the like button yes and subscribe and we'll see you on the next one Somebody just replied. <laughs> the kids up in that garden just replied a yeah. Oh dear. <laughs>